Pat, congratulations on the win. Can you talk me through from a Springbok perspective how you think the game went? Yeah, look, obviously we're very happy um, that we came out with the win, especially after last week. It was important for us to bounce back uh, with a victory. Um, but look, there's, there's a lot to work on still. Um, so we're very pleased with the win, but we'll be looking, uh, looking at the drawing board on Monday and, and seeing where we can improve. What was being said at 20 all in that second half? What was, the, what was being said amongst the your players? Look, I think uh, that was a time when, uh, when everyone needed to, sh needed to show some character, um, something that we've spoken about during the week. So uh, the message was very clear, um, which was focused on what we needed to do to, to get our, our control of the game again and to come out on top on the scoreboard. You've played the Rugby Championship, of course, recently against the, the top teams in the world. How would you compare this match against England out there to those ones you've recently played? Um, I think the conditions were, were very tricky today. I think that ball was very slip, slippery and wet. Um, and obviously, uh, England have a really good uh, defensive structure and they, they put you under pressure with a, a big line speed. Um, but look, the physicality was right up there with, uh, with the, the previous test matches. I think this was similar um, conditions that we're going to get in the World Cup next year. Um, and it was a real test match rugby out there today. So, yeah. What's really about Victor Matfield's continued influence on this team? He seems to have a massive game out there. Yeah, Victor, um, he's a role model for us all. I think uh, at his age, he's still be doing what he's doing. He still runs in front when you do fitness and he still takes charge when you're out there on the field. So it's fantastic to have uh, uh, such experience in, in Victor um, and for, for the rest of us to learn from him. How pleased are you with your own performance, getting a chance in the 10 shirt? Look, I, I really enjoyed um, getting a start today. Um, it didn't go as wonderfully as I'd hoped, but at the end of the day, we came up with a win and I think that's the most important thing for this team. Um, and we, we'll be looking to build on this performance and take some momentum into the rest of the tour. So what does it do to your confidence ahead of the World Cup next year? You hopefully playing some big games back here again? Yeah, again, we, we've, um, we've had a happy record here at Twickenham um, in the past few years. Um, it's an amazing stadium to play at. Um, so I guess that does give us some confidence thinking that the World Cup's going to be back here next year. But look, there's still a lot of rugby to be played. There's, there's still a lot that can happen between now and then. Um, and we're not going to get too far ahead of ourselves. Next week we've got Italy and we'll be looking to put in a good performance.